Hey, my name's Derek, and today I'm going to teach you how to create a blog entry on chwradio.ca. Once you've created your chw web account, click on Login on the top right-hand corner. Enter your username, password, and click Login. Once you've logged in, you'll be brought to a Create Content page. On this page, you can click on Blog Entry to start blogging. You can also click on Create Content on the sidebar menu. Once you click on Create Content, you'll click on Blog Entry. If you don't see the side menu, simply click on the little wrench icon that's located on the top left-hand corner of the web page. Once you've clicked on Blog Entry, you'll be brought to a Create Blog Entry page. From here, type in your title, select your topic, and upload an image for the banner. To upload your blog banner, simply click on Choose File in the Image section. Select the image you want to use on your computer. Double-click that image, and then click Upload. From here, you can type out a description of the image you just uploaded. Remember that the image for your blog entry banner should be 640 pixels by 250 pixels. For your blog entry, you can choose to type it out in the body section or choose to type it out in a Word document. If you type it out in Microsoft Word, select and copy the text from your Word document and then click on the Paste from Word button located on the top menu of the body section. From here, paste the text in the pop-up window and click OK. The text you had from your Word document will now appear on the body section in proper formats. Underneath the body section, you can choose to upload various audio files and a gallery. In the audio section, click Choose File. Select the audio file that you want to upload, double-click it, and click Upload. Within this audio section, you can choose to upload various songs, interviews, and even audio you recorded at a live event. Now, you can type a description about the audio file. If you want to add more than one audio file, simply click on Add Another Item underneath the audio section. Again, click on Choose File, double-click the selected audio file, and click Upload. It is important to keep in mind that the maximum file size that you can upload is 20 megabytes. If you decide that you don't want to upload a certain audio file, simply click Remove. Underneath the audio section, you can also upload various images to create a gallery. Simply click on Choose File, double-click your desired image, and click Upload. From here, you can type out a description, alternate text, and a title for your image. Again, you can click on Add Another Item underneath the Gallery section to upload more images. Once you have completed your blog entry, simply click Save. Once you click Save, your blog entry is not automatically published. You can always revisit your blog entry and make changes by clicking on My Account on the side menu and click on View My Account. Near the bottom of this page, there will be an Unpublished Posts section. From here, click on Edit beside the title of the blog entry you want to make changes to. To make your blog entry more interesting, you can also create web links and embed certain kinds of media such as video, audio, and various playlists. Click here to learn how to create web links and embed media into your blog entry.